The population of inmates at the Youth Training Center, the St. Michael Home for Boys, and similar agencies are increasing on a daily basis. And with no aftercare program, the issue of recidivism continues to be of concern to prison officials. Assistant Superintendent at YTC Dennis Pulchan believes fathers need to be more responsible. We have observed that there's a lack of father figure in their life. That role model is absent. And uh, we believe that if that role model is present in their life, it will make a dramatic uh, difference in their lives. I am definitely calling on the fathers to come out and, and, and do their role, perform their, their, their function, and provide that, that, that leadership and, and um, build capacity in their, their children's lives. ASP Pulchan made these statements at the fourth annual Angel Tree program held at the Youth Training Center today. Parents of inmates expressed their joy had been able to share this time with their loved ones. Happy as a lark. Real happy. And her son Jamil Davison could not hide his feelings, both good and bad. On um, behalf of the people that are wrong now, it's like telling them know well, I'm sorry and that and my integration now, I'll be a whole new being uh, taking rehabilitation program I'm serious and I don't want them to view me as the same person as when I came in at first. Now. Kurt Stewart, the lone father to attend this function, was also elated. Today means a lot. First thing first that I really love my son, right? I know he did something wrong, but no matter what, you have to love your child. While his son also expressed his remorse. Sorry, well, I don't have to forgiveness. The Angel Tree is an annual program that are brought into the system to reintegrate with their children before their release date. For CNC3, I am Samuel McKnight.